Hi, welcome back for a video. Um, today we're going to be doing a October, November favorites mixed together because, yeah, I didn't do October. <laughs> so I hope you're doing well. Um, I'm doing great. And uh, let's start. So my first favorite, it's a favorite that I already spoken about. Um, Pure Rose Hip Seed Oil. I love this thing. It's amazing. And let me see if I can show you. So, yep, yep, there you go. So I love it for moisturizing my skin, my face. Um, I use it also the other day on my hair. Loved it. Um, the smell though, and it has a smell, and the smell will go away on your face quicker than on your hair, basically. But um, I love it. Very moisturizing. I know I shouldn't, but that's the only moisturizer I use on my face. And I love it so yeah a plus I think it was eight dollars on Amazon something like that but I need another bottle <sighs> I was late but I tried it and I love it and I know I make my own toner apple cider vinegar with um, a bit of water and I put also add a little um, rose water but this just makes your face really it glows like it claims it it's good it's good um so pixie skin treats glow tonic exfoliating toner um five percent glyconic aloe vera and ginseng good can i show you oh okay here you go i'm sorry <laughs> here you go yeah um i the only thing is i i live in montreal when I went to the States, that's when I bought it. It wasn't cheap. But uh, I think I bought this little bottle for $14. Like, come on, people. Come on. The States supposed to be cheap. <laughs> anyway, but apparently, if you live in Montreal, you can find it in uh, Winners. That's what I've heard. So, love this. Here now. I went back to my pills. I need my pills. <laughs> <Back to them. laughs> the main choice metabolism, main metabolism, health, healthy hair, vitamin, hair growth and retention solution, longer, thicker, healthier. And it works. Let me just show you. It works. It really works. Like your hair is growing slowly, but your hair is growing. And the thing is, you have to remember. It's not about just taking supplements. You also have to use other things. Like I'm gonna show you, I also use oil in combination with this pill. And also, you know, massaging your hair, um, not touching it every day, leave it alone. Um, my hair is like this today because yesterday I took off my braids. And um, so yeah, like try to do protective styles so you don't use, always put your hands in your hair. I know it's hard. <laughs> but do it and you'll see your hair is really gonna grow um i'm not gonna lie supplements for me is a big thing i need supplements i i need them i need them yeah it helps my hair a lot the thing i use in combination with this those supplements is um oil and castor oil um this one though it's not what was in the bottle i finished what was in the bottle and I used um, an oil called Croissance Plus. I don't know. Yeah. Anyway, it's at my local beauty store. And um, for those of you who lives who live in Montreal, Mama Africa is the shit. If you don't know that, why? Why? Like you need to go for hand extensions, for hair extensions, for any products you need. Most definitely, she will have it. And it's not. It's not cheap, but it's not expensive butter. Like, hello. Like, she's good. She's really good. So anyway, I use, I have used this for, what, five, six years now? When I used to have my hair a little bit longer before I cut them, <laughs> uh, uh, I used to use this oil, and it did wonders for me. I have to admit, the smell's not great. Mm, yep. But you had to do what you have to do to grow your hair, right? So, your hair will love this. Um, another favorite, do I go to face? Let's go to face, whatever again. Uh, well, 
I use this on my face and body. I don't use it as much on my face because I'm scared that it's too scented. It has too much fragrance in it. It smells though. It smells good though. I love to put this on my body at night because when you go to sleep, it's very soothing and like, oh, it just it smells good and you wake up the next morning and you still smell like it. Um, this is Caudalie Divine Oil Body Face Hair. I never tried it in my hair. So uh, another favorite and always will be a favorite and I'm almost out of it and I need to go buy another one. Uh, Laura Mercier Foundation. Um, that's what I'm wearing right now. Gives you better coverage and for, it depends what you need. But a better coverage and it stays longer and the color I find suits me better um, so very glad I went back to this and <laughs> it's almost done <laughs> it's almost done but hey love it pricey but worth it next one is uh I was with a friend of mine <laughs> I swear black false lashes extreme black and she was right they're good it's good I bought the little sample size because I didn't know if I would like it, so I didn't want to spend, I think it's like 20 something dollars for the big, for the big version. But, um, I like it. It's good. I love the brush. For my type of lashes, this brush is the bomb. Yep. It helps. A lot. I don't know if you can, yeah, you won't be able to see my lashes, but I love it. Um, hemp. Sorry. Hemp hand protector. Um, for those of you who doesn't know what hemp is, is you know the plant marijuana plant. Anyway, but hey, I love it. Um, it's very very good. It really really moisturizes your hand for a long time. It's a tiny bit greasy, like it leaves like a like a silicone finish, kind of. I don't know how to explain it. Like there's a but it's your hand is soft and it's moisturized for a long time, so that's what you want. So, yeah, I have I have three of them. I love them so much. I used to love. I used to prefer the um, almond one. For sure, it smells delicious. But um, this one does a better job. And since I have eczema, like you know, I have a tendency to have a lot of dry skin. So I like my hands to stay really soft, like it is right now. <laughs> so I love this cream. Um, but check it out because um, even if you don't like, you wouldn't like this scent, um, go to Body Shop and check out their hand creams. They're pretty good. I know they have another one and the third one, if I'm not mistaken, is um, Rose Scented, something like that. But it's very good. Oh, the cutie! I had to. I just saw somebody on YouTube having the blueberry one, if I'm not mistaken. And I had to get it. It's so cute. This one is the peach one. Let me see. Yeah. I know. You can't see much, but I love it. Yeah. Yeah. But I love it. Um, from Tony Moly. Tony Moly. Tony Moly. Whatever. Love them. It's moisturizing. It is. I apply most of the time this before I apply a lip stain because... If you wear lip stain, you know what I mean. Talking about lip stain, the color I'm wearing right now is from Sephora and Okay. The color is 707 from Sephora. Yeah. That's the color I'm wearing. I like it. But <laughs> I just started to wear it even though I bought it a year ago. But don't ask questions. <laughs> Uh, favorite nail polish for October was this color right here. Sick, sick. I love it. It was a bright orange and gorgeous. I was walking with my boyfriend. We just came out from eating, and uh, there was a girl right in front of me. She had this color type of. Honestly, I'm pretty sure it was the same color of nail polish on her nails, and I was like, "Oh my god, so gorgeous." And my boyfriend's like, no, you don't need it. I'm like, yes, I do. Yes, I do. You don't know, but I do. <laughs> so <laughs> I went to uh, a drugstore and I bought it. Yeah, I know. But it's gorgeous on the skin. If you want to see, I posted pictures on my Instagram um, wearing this color. It's um, Sally Hansen Hard As Nails Extreme Wear and Color 
hot tamale. Mm. 170. Gorgeous. I love salience and, and these in Montreal are like 247, 297. They're so cheap, like and they're amazing. You don't even need and the picture on Instagram, I'm not even wearing a top coat. So listen, they're good. Um cold weather means hot drinks. <laughs> yes. And uh I have been adding in all my hot drinks like tea because um, I drink a lot of tea and uh, my matcha I have been adding this it's from David's tea and it's called aguave biology no organic aguave vanilla sorry I was re reading in French but in English <laughs> um, basically it's a syrup a nectar and it has a little hint of vanilla in it it's really good and it for people who likes to add a lot of sugar and you know who doesn't use necessarily the good sugar um this is good and you can bring it wherever you go especially when you go and sleep over at people's place like i bring it with me when i go to my boyfriend's so well i'm actually on my boyfriend so anyway love it and ha ah, my matcha <laughs> i can't i can't i discovered matcha like what uh two years ago and i can't stop drinking it like I'm so addicted to matcha, it's like not even normal, but anyway. Um, this one, anyway, I'll tell you, matcha mocha. I tried the matcha vanilla. No, it doesn't taste like vanilla or, I don't know, it's weird. Um, and this one is my favorite. I, oh, and the mocha mint is good. It's good. The mocha mint is good. But uh, the matcha mocha... The mocha mint? The matcha mint, sorry, <laughs> is good. But the matcha mocha, I think, is my favorite. Because um, I like the little cacao like aftertaste, like so I like it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, love it. I think I drink one, a big cup of this every night. Like, oh my god. <laughs> anyway, so that one was my favorite for October and November. Um, I'm gonna start doing more videos, but it's hard <laughs> to make videos and to find the right time and to have the sun, you know, on your side and meaning, you know, to have the right lighting, the right place and stuff. So I'm gonna, whatever. I hope you have an amazing day or week or month and it's Christmas. We're gonna have snow. We're gonna have snow. I know. I'm crazy. I love snow. Yeah. I do. Until I have a car and I have to shovel. But for now, I do. <laughs> Bye.